Northwest University students say they're living in fear after the death of another student at a campus residence in Mahikeng. Mabatu Cornelia Sesini, a 20-year-old first-year student, passed away at the Khatolo off-campus re residence this weekend. It's the second student to die at the university's residence in as many months. Nkhopoze Khelezani, a 23-year-old student, was also found dead last month. Police are currently investigating the causes of those deaths. Our reporter, Rufule Seboko, has more. Nkhopoze and Mataba are two students who perished in their university residence in a space of two months. This is yet another tragic incident that has left the university in a state of shock. One student who wanted to remain anonymous and stays at the same residence where Matabo perished describes what she saw on the day of the tragic incident. I was going to the shop, mm. so then when I look back, I saw her lying on the side but facing the door's direction. Then uh, I was like, maybe she, there's something like, she, she wanted help or something. Then when I come back from the shops, I saw the, the, the paramedics car. Then when I look at them, like they were carrying some, some sort of best kit things. Then they rushed to her only to find her that she was no more. The student says Matabo was someone who was at peace with everyone and she doesn't feel safe anymore. As I've heard some other people saying that this is not the first incident to happen, so I, I'm really confused, like I don't know what, how to feel and what, what to feel because it, it seems like we are not safe anymore. The university says it has arranged counselling for students who are personally affected by the death of their fellow students. The Northwest University is deeply saddened by the passing away of a 20-year-old student at the Mahi campus in the afternoon of this past Tuesday. Ms. Matabu Cornelia Sisinyi, a first-year BA communication student, was a resident at the Gatolo private off-campus residence. We really want to send our condolences to Ms. Sisinyi's family, her fellow students and friends. The Northwest University has also in the meantime arranged for counselling for everybody that was in contact with her just to make sure that it becomes a bit easier for them to handle. Once again, to lose a student or a staff member is bad for the university as a whole. The police have cautioned people from spreading unconfirmed rumors about the case and should allow the police to conclude their investigation. Police in the Northwest can confirm that the body of a 20-year-old student was found on Tuesday in Mather King. The police opened an inquest and are currently busy with the investigation. For News from Africa on Channel 405, I'm Refule Seboko in Mahikeng in the Northwest.